back. No, how are we going? Oh, okay. Hmm. Ah, uh, Yvonne is about to leave. Um, let's let's just let him go. Well, <laughs> see you, Yvonne. Uh huh. Maybe we'll meet again someday. Until then, princess. Yvonne leaves. He really does. From some of the things he said, it was like he's been following us around all this time. Ha! No way, right? That's silly, ha! Huh? Right? Heck yeah. Soon after, you meet up with Florin, Anton, and some guy they're dragging out. Florin! Anton! I'm glad the two of you are alright. <sighs> that should be our line. What the hell? Are you alright? Did you get hurt at all? No, nope, not even a scratch. See? Fine. Thank goodness. Indeed. The guy that Florin and Anton had dr along with them also sighs relieved. Oof. <laughs> yeah, lucky for, for you, huh? This guy, this is the guy who shapeshifted into you. Perfectly, you know, replicated your boobs and such. I'm, I'm sorry about that again. I'm not actually part of the bandits. They just hired me to do this. Oh, sorry. Ah, uh -huh. I wonder what Florin and Anton made him go through. It's fine, I guess. <laughs> I was sure surprised when you turned into me all of a sudden, no? It was a nightmare for all of us, I assure you. And the funniest thing that I have ever voiced, I swear. <laughs> At the same time, it seems like he won't be doing any of this again. Anything like this again. Lady Shale, your sword. Anton gives you back your sword. <gasps> Thank you! Oh, what a relief! She likes this sword more than either of you, huh? <clears throat> ah, sorry! I'm sorry! <laughs> Looks like everything's back in place now. How did you escape, anyway? And why did the bandits go for you in the first place? It's... kinda complicated. And scary. Uh, let's just say the bandits mistook me for someone. <laughs> and then someone broke into the hideout and helped me. Huh, what a coincidence. Sure it was! Ha ha! Ha ha! Ha! Uh, so, can I go now, please? Not so fast. We're bringing you back into town first. The bandit's hideout is right there. Do you think we trust you enough to let you go free just yet? What? Like a call for help or something? I'd never do something like that. Yeah, we're gonna make sure you won't. Come on, let's go. I haven't forgiven you just yet. Sorry! But I guess I deserve it. Florin and the imposter go ahead of you and Anton. <sighs> huh? I don't think I've ever heard you sigh like that, Anton. Are you feeling alright? I am fine. I was simply... worried. A little bit. Please do not run off like that again, no matter what the reason. I... <coughs> we... Won't be able to reach you. Yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh. Even though I said I'd take better care of myself, I guess I messed up a little bit. I'm sorry, Anton. I should have been more careful. Yes. Well. It's fine now, as long as you were not hurt. There wasn't any way for you to know what was going to happen. The blame for the situation falls upon the bandits. The ban bandits. Bandits. Can I pronounce words? I cannot. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. It isn't your fault. Er, nope, that was f that was fucked up. It isn't your fault. Even so, you certainly seem unfazed by the situation. Even danger like this won't deter you from traveling, I see. You're not going to bring me back to MRI now, are you? <laughs> no, I will not. Re really 
As I said, this incident was not your fault. Yeah. Thank you, Anton. I was worried that you'd be mad or at me or something. I see. Please excuse me if I seem irritated at the moment. It was difficult to think about the worst outcome. I may be less collected than you right now. <laughs> what are you talking about? You're always calm, Anton. I was pretty worried when I woke up in the hideout, actually. But then it was already over by the time I knew it. I, I see. I should have been more careful, too. I believe I may have let my guard down. Perhaps I'm going soft. What? No, no way. In that case, I'd be scared to see the real serious Anton. Preferably, you should be more fearful of situations like the one today. Yeah, probably. Maybe a little bit. I probably should be a little bit more scared. But for some reason, I had the feeling that you'd come eventually. <laughs> it's only natural. I am still a knight. Oh, uh, I actually meant something else. What? N now that I think about it, I had this weird feeling that you'd be here. Huh. You know, something's been on my mind lately, but I'm not sure what it is exactly. Ah, not in a weird way or anything. It feels like something's missing a little bit. And now that we've been talking to each other more, it's been bothering me a little bit. I, I wonder why. There's no need to think so hard about it. It's more than likely... It isn't anything important. <sighs> hey, Florian is way ahead of us. That imposter really put him in a bad mood. You go ahead and catch up with Florian. <sighs> it's coming undone after all. And the more time she spends with me, the more likely that she'll... <clears throat> Did I make the right decision that day? More importantly, am I making the right decision now? Oh, dude, she's gonna fucking remember. No! We probably should take a short break here, actually. <laughs> Let's take a short break here. A lot just happened now, after all. Oh, but I should mention that what I'm telling you isn't all that happened. No, 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 no. They had countless adventures in between, too. Keep that in mind. Yeah, yeah, don't worry about that. Don't you worry. They had tons of adventures, plenty of time to fall in the loves. Yes. <laughs> <laughs>